Let's go to Rob now with more on this house being moved in Ebor. Yeah, Meredith, thank you very much. The house you're looking at right here, this is the home of Tampa legend Al Lopez, Tampa's very first Major League Baseball player, also his first Hall of Famer. This is a 100-ton house moving through the streets of Ybor City. Let me tell you how difficult of a project this has been, though. This house was supposed to be moved uh, by 4 o'clock this morning. They started at 8 o'clock last night. The crews here told me they were supposed to have the house down on the foundation a block from here about two hours ago. Well, clearly they've hit some snags here, but where this house is headed, though, it's headed to uh, 19th Street here in Ybor City to become a baseball museum celebrating about 125 years of baseball history. Today at 11 o'clock this morning, they're going to have a dedication ceremony with Al Lopez Jr., Al Lopez's son, out here. Um, you know, they're going to renovate the house. They're going to fix it up. By spring, they're hoping to have this museum open. But let me tell you, though, there's another house that's also been moving down the street here, not too far from here. But it's going to become a Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office Museum. But as you can see how slow this has been going, hopefully by 11 o'clock they'll have it down and we'll have something for you like a celebration, the commemoration ceremony on putting this on its new foundation. In Ybor City, I'm Rob Munoz, ABC Action News.